this is my sixth year at the Inclusion Summit. I've never missed anyone. I was always on the other side. Today I have this wonderful opportunity to be here in front of you and what an honor it is. Our young people got the opportunity to print all of the lovely t-shirts that many, many of you are wearing. And I'm very, very grateful to India Inclusion Summit team for giving us this opportunity. You won't believe what a big difference it has made to us. This was one of our first major orders in block printing. I thought it just stopped there. Just a couple of days ago, Sridhar wrote and said, Jai ma'am, can you just come and share your story? So nice of him. Is he here? No, Firoz is here. Hi, Firoz. And that was like, you know, it, it took me a minute and say, oh my God, at the summit, I'm going to say something? Oh, that's awesome. But then I told Sridhar that instead of talking, if I can show what our kids are doing, I think that will be a great honor to what we have to do. Most of you will know that autism spectrum disorder is a very, very complex and a difficult condition. And a fortunate few are on the higher functioning with a lot of capabilities who will make it into the mainstream uh, employment and living, provided we do our job right from the very beginning. Uh, but there will be, uh, I think, a si significant population as of now, because that's what research is still telling us, that who will need the support. And when we see the kind of investment we make on the kids, uh, not just finance, but huge energy, time, emotion that goes into dealing with the children, training them, the families that have to go through. Uh, unless we see that there is something in it for all of them when they grow, I think all what we do becomes insignificant. And that is one of the ways we were looking at education and saying that what is it that we are going to offer when they get older. And uh, by chance, we figured that, you know, the kids can are good with colors, good with art, and whether we can take that a step forward. And one of our parent teachers found out that, you know, block printing would be a great way to go ahead. So one is that, you know, they're very visual sk skills, so individuals find that very convenient. It's also very structured. They know exactly what to do. But most importantly, it, uh, you know, it, it gives a way forward for us in the mainstream. Because after all, fashion, clothing was there, generations, it's going to be there for generations. So that's nothing new. And all of us here have overflowing closets that we need to empty every couple of months. And I'm sure our apparel will definitely be a will take a pride in your, in your place. In fact, the one that I'm wearing, I'm so proud to be wearing what my kids make. So, uh, thank you. So this is what we are looking at and uh, we are hope that you will see our sample work here. This is not a professional uh, presentation. Uh, maybe the professional presentation will come next year if Firoz uh, still invites us. We will give you a very good show next year. But this is uh, what I wanted to pitch here was that how do we then take this forward? So individuals, I, I'm not very sure we can take on bulk bulk uh, numbers. We do that for a while, but it's we call it limited edition or we call it special edition. So it's a special occasion because each one has got a different color and this pattern and everything. So we have gifting items for everybody. Even, even for your secret Valentine, we can ship it off wherever you want. <laughs> Won't be a problem. So what I'm looking for is people with ideas of design, color combination, you know, to support us because everything that parent or the teacher can't take on. And also for the corporates, if you're looking at giving some very special gifts to your high-end customers or your you know, favorite employees, that is somewhere that you will be able to do. So this has been an endeavor to bring people with significant challenges into the mainstream, to make them productive, to make them happy 
and then you know for us also to be very proud of what they do so it's a wonderful uh, opportunity for us to showcase what we are here we have infants we have children on the spectrum we have young adults on the spectrum we have uh, professionals who are not connected at all this was quickly put together we said who can volunteer who can volunteer you know and everybody said yes yes we will do but they all own what they are wearing okay so big round of applause to this team and i really hope that you enjoy our little presentation we have a stall outside my team will be here and we'll be definitely look forward to taking this forward and firoz thank you very very much for this thank you jayashri for that introduction okay we now have the ramp walk it's an inclusive ramp walk which has individuals with autism parents of special children special educators and a few friends of npt we are showcasing products creatively block printed by young adults with autism so please give it up for all the participants today <laughs> we first have sindhu and maitri coming My three is wearing a lovely t-shirt printed with leaves, and Sindhu has a beautiful mask printed on a dupatta. We have next Gauri and Siam. Siam has a beautiful geometric print on his kurta, while Gauri is showcasing a silk dupatta with a double color block print. I'm too blind and you are cool oh, oh, oh. Yes you watch that's me the way you walk yeah it's like a food I don't care look at that kids are trying what they done do you like me will you see I don't care where it gets its time Mahendra can 
you show your birds on the front? Can you point out to the birds? Okay, let's hear it for the designer and Mahendra once again. Thank you. We next have Shubha and Abai. Shubha is coming in an orange sari with a border print and Abai has a trendy geometric print on his t-shirt. We do printing for all ages and for all occasions, even all kinds of textiles. Wow, look at the style. We now have little kids walking the rock. on his t-shirt. Nidhi has got nice umbrellas and Avni has a traditional print on a kurta. Yay! Aren't they lovely? We have children saying hi. Yes! We next have Mamta and her daughter coming on stage. Mamta has a double block printed sari. Double block. And a cute little daughter with her. A double block print needs lot of skill. And our, our children are trained very well to do a double block printing as well. <laughs> She's got the moves. Set it on fire. We now have Deepika and Arav, our youngest uh, walker. Deepika is wearing a very trendy outfit, a fashionable palazzo with print at the bottom. Hi, look at Arav. Arav's got umbrellas all over his t shirt and a nice little coat. Aram is going to be a model, I'm sure. So that was our youngest uh, participant of the day. We now have Dikshita coming on. Dikshita is a volunteer for us from Gift Table. And she's wearing a nice sari along with Pushkar and Anand. Spots printed on the kurtas, so you can see we can print any any kind of clothes, any kind of design. So you name it and we will have it printed for you. Wow, they've got style, the three of them. A big round for them, please. Okay, we now have the kids back on the stage. I think they are loving it, so they're coming back again. Yeah! Hi kids, wave your hand. Say a big hi. Okay, we have all the participants back on the stage, please. Yes! Children, you can wave your hands. Yeah, give them a big high five. I'm too violent and you are The showstoppers again, Mahindra and Purnima. You watch me smile and dance like a fool. I don't care cause you do like me Do like me We'll lose it all and we'll be free Yeah, so now we have everybody 
Thank you so much. We are so happy to be here. Thank you once again.